And so, nine nights as the embodiment of the might of the... You have stepped from the humble shadows of obscurity and into legend. No feat you have accomplished in your life compares to what you have become. You are an embodiment of Pelinul Whitestrake, the bane of Umarul the Unfeathered. The time has come for you to fulfill your destiny. Umara lies hid in the ancient fane of Garlas Malatar. You must go there and destroy him. No. Should you face Umaru, you would suffer the same fate as Pelinal. But times change, and even the shape of the divine itself must change with it. Where once there were eight, now one more stands with them, and they have become nine. I, with the apotheosis of Tiber Septum, the face of the divine was transformed. Talos ascended, and the eight became <laughs> nine. So, although you wear the armor of the gods, it is incomplete. A relic of the old ways and the old gods. As a proven guardian of this realm, and a warrior the likes of which have not been seen in millennia, Talos grants you his sacred blessing with the ancient gifts of the eight and the new gift of the one you are ready to face Umaril it will allow you to follow Umaril into the spirit realm upon his death it will allow you to destroy him body and soul utterly and for all time you must first kill his living body. While beyond the power of most mortals, this is only the lesser of your two tasks. His Daedric nature allows his spirit to escape into oblivion after death. Oh, this is what Pelinal learned upon defeating Umaril the first time. But you can do what Pelinal could not. The blessings of Talos will allow you to follow Umaril's spirit when it leaves his body. This you must do, and you must not fail. You will not, because the Nine fight with you. Your knights will assemble at Garlas Malatar and await you there. Gather all those who you deem worthy. Not all who enter those halls shall return. Those who fall in service of the Nine will live on forever in the halls of their fathers. I wish you well on your quest, Crusader. We are depending on you. Yes, Commander? Hail, Sir Knight. My brother and I have heard that you are founding a holy order of knights, and we would like to offer you our sword. We've come all the way from Skyrim to join up. We can't claim any experience as knights, but we'll learn soldiering from our years in the Legion. Will you have us? You won't regret it, sir. You'll find us true-hearted and brave. I'll be back as soon as I've outfitted myself. Sir Knight, allow me to introduce myself. I am Brelin of Sylvanar, at your service. I come to offer myself as a knight in service of Oriel, or Akatosh, as he is known in Cyrodiil. I bring nothing but my skill with the blade, which is not inconsiderable, and my devotion to the Lord Oriel. Will you accept me, as unworthy as I am? I am honored to join the Order under your illustrious command. Excuse me while I go to the armory and attire myself as befits a Knight of the Nine. Well met, Sir Knight.
Well met, Sir Knight. <laughs>